Hello, everybody, and welcome to Talk to the Hand. It's a podcast of people talking absolute shit. I am joined by Mr. Show. Hello, this is Angry Chimp. Fuck the show. <laughs> I am joined in um, in Down Under, Inside Outland, uh, in Australia, Shock Mouse. Hello. And I'm joined in, in Mystery America Land by the Chaotic Innovator special guest. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> It, right, just, just, just like for dedication, right? It's five in the fucking morning, and we made Innovator wake up to to record this podcast with us. Why? Why did you consent to this shit? Uh, cause I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> wow, that's no reason some... at all. <laughs> <laughs> that's some. Uh, that's some brilliant size. Uh, yeah, that's real insightful. That's real insightful. Got some I'm knowledge to we... share. Yeah, I'm glad we invited you now with that with you know such knowledge being passed down as to <laughs> Yeah, why? Why? Why why would you be on this podcast? <laughs> Are you I, on Mountie time? Because I don't know what I'm talking about, just like you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I have you know, I know what I'm talking about. Shocks, do you? No. <laughs> <laughs> So Hello. how is everybody? How is everybody? What's, Come on, let's catch what's up. What's going on in other. the news? <laughs> uh, I I am too tired to continue. Um, I I feel like I should just like take an extended vacation and just sort of sleep forever. What about you? It's <laughs> which one are you talking to there? <laughs> just the audience at large. <laughs> All I see is this Halloween video that I've been editing for about a month now. Oh wow! How long is it? It's like between 15 and 18 minutes long. You madman. <laughs> yes. Yes, I am. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, um, Shock Mouse, Steve, what Pete does is he makes content. He doesn't just, like, whack out 50-second videos like you. <laughs> Hi, guys. It's another one of those lips not animated videos. <laughs> hey, that one went for four minutes. <laughs> it's, another, it's another one of those I couldn't give a fuck videos. <laughs> Because why try harder? YouTube.com slash shock mouse. I'm going to fly there one day, and then you're going to be very fucking quiet, aren't you? Oh, I swore. Even that, you're going to be more confused, because you're not quite sure how you got there. <laughs> if you're, you, won't, you won't go to England, you'll go to Iceland or something. Yeah. Like, Fuck, I'm in the wrong country. <laughs> <laughs> Let's try that. <laughs> Do you know what I've started doing with my baby? I've started going, huh? and she finds it hysterical. <laughs> yeah, she finds it funny now. <laughs> you won't find it funny when you go to pay for therapy. Yeah, but basically in another sort of 27 years, she's going to be on a podcast going, when I was a baby, yeah. my dad used to look at me and go, <laughs> no, Chim, <laughs> no, Chim. Her dad would look at her and go, uh, not, ow. <laughs> <laughs> Get that all right, right. So I, I, all right, all right. Hang on a second. I, I I've got an honest it. question. I've got an honest no. question, Chim. Before you, before you continue, I've got an honest question. Innovator, can you do this following noise? Uh? Uh? You see, you see, <laughs> it's only Chim that can't do it. It's only Chim that can't do it. All right, all right. I was going to ask the same question actually, Pete. So me and you have the same mind. Right, I'm going to have another go at this. <coughs> uh? <laughs> almost, almost. You're getting there. A bit more practice. <laughs> I need to. I need to watch Home Improvements. You do. <laughs> I do admit, I didn't really watch it that much. No. No, I watched it. Missed out. Times, but, That's why you missed uh, out. Tim, yeah. Tim. Tim Allen is it? Was Tim Allen? Was it? Was it Tim Allen? Yeah, Tim Allen. <laughs> yeah, it was Tim <laughs> Allen. <laughs> oh, fucking <laughs> answer me, gun. I don't even know who that is. <laughs> I um. Yeah, I can't stand that bloke. So that's why I didn't watch it. Right. <laughs> Even as a kid, what, a little kid, you're like, I can't stand that black man. <laughs> That's right, yeah. <laughs> Tough, he's still coming over every fucking night. <laughs> Go to sleep. <laughs> for a little bit of, for a little bit of, <laughs> a little bit of, <laughs> but mum, I can't sleep. There's all these banging on the walls. So I'm going to sleep. We never talk about <laughs> it. <laughs> Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Sorry, I'm so wrong in it. Home improvements. 
<laughs> okay, shall we shall we just sort of quickly escape this conversation and go to conversationstarters.com, which is our, our, our crutch for this podcast? Well, no, we, we, we should probably <laughs> give Chronic Innovator the chance to plug his channel. Oh, yes. plug time! Should we just get like a plugging theme? Uh, we can make another one up if you want. Yeah, plug, all right, plug, okay, plug, we're going to do... Plug. No, 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 I'm not making any more themes. No, <laughs> come on, we got to do a theme, okay? we got to have a theme for everything, Chimp, okay? Oh, for fuck's sake. Right. Drone men plugging up the drone channel. <laughs> is plugging the channel. <laughs> you plugging <laughs> YouTube <laughs> channel. <laughs> plugging <laughs> shit. Plug, 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 Oh, this was worth it. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to appease us. <laughs> don't be using those big words at this time in the morning, all right? <laughs> big words? <laughs> it's like eight It's seven! <laughs> it's seven letters! <laughs> God, it's dark here. <laughs> One day, he's window. gonna die on the podcast, and we're like, gonna go, uh, uh, how do we call 999 or whatever it is? Do we call 999? <laughs> <laughs> how do we call 999? When you've got Angry like Chip 9 Show, 1, but like in more well educated countries. When you've got oh, Angry so, Chip Show, who yeah, lives in the UK himself. Hold a different number three times. <laughs> Hey, Chuck Rams, what are you on? <laughs> it is nine nine nine, there, isn't it? Yes. Uh, yes. What is this? Wait for. I I I know. <laughs> it's not a hard thing, though, is it? How do I dial nine nine nine? That's not a question. That's just stupid. <laughs> no, that number upside you down. Is... You pick up your phone and you press nine three times. Then you press call. Fuck a lot of you. That's not the question. The question isn't how do I dial nine nine nine. The question more so is what do I tell nine nine nine? It's like hi nine nine nine. That's not, the question. That's not what you ask. You ask how do I call nine nine nine? A Skype call with a gentleman. Though I do not know where he lives, but I just heard him have a heart attack. Could you please go figure out where he lives? Right. -o. <laughs> On it, governor. <laughs> All, right. All right, governor. <laughs> Was your man called Peter Day? He's, he's all like cashed out in his house, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> so you could go over there and help him out. He's, he's a good lad. <laughs> right, uh, so we were right, meant to be plugging a channel, Connick and then Innovator. we got to this. <laughs> Con yeah, Chronic Innovator still has not plugged his channel. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know no. if you have it in the description or not. <laughs> do you? Some Sometimes do people do that. I don't know if they do or not. We have a, some kind of description. Normally it's as gibberish as this podcast. Because <laughs> <laughs> I write it. I don't know. At one point you asked for the link, so I was like, all right, he's going to like put it in the description. Yeah, yeah, I will do, but uh, you can still plug. T -t -t Tell the people what you do on your channel. T -t -t Tell. T -t -t Tell. <laughs> I heavily way. criticize video games, mostly Fallout 4 at this point, because Fallout 4 really pisses me off. It's just so broken, isn't it? It's, it's like, just, yeah. it's, like, it's, it's, it's like so far it's from recurring... what the franchise used to be. It's a recurring exactly. theme from Bethesda, I find, that they just, they can't put out a finished game. That would be one of the things, they just, there's so many bugs. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm going to agree God. with you up until they send me merchandise, and then when they send me merchandise, I'm going to then wear it on the podcast, <laughs> and then go, no, they're great, what are you talking about? It's going to be professionally silenced. <laughs> yes. And people complain at me for being a Tesco sellout. Yeah, fucking Tesco sellouts. It's all about the Morrisons, cunt. No, it's all about Tesco right, no, orange juice. No, we had this. We had this discussion on your live stream on Saturday, right? Yes. And people agreed with me. Right. <clears throat> except I'm right because it's my and live you, stream. You, right? You are a peasant. <laughs> Shopping at Tesco. Drunken <laughs> peasants. Like we're not advertising <laughs> other podcasts on this podcast. Fuck the drunken peasants. <laughs> Fuck them right in the ass. It's just falling apart. <laughs> right, random topic generator. What celebrities do you like? <laughs> Jesus. Uh, that's a very personal question. I like Tim Allen. Chester Bennington a little bit from the Lincoln Park. There you go. <laughs> Tim Allen for Shock Mouse. Uh, <laughs> 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 it's going to be a porn yeah, I'll... star. I'll take that. <laughs> Ah, oh, what about you, chimp? 
Um, at this point in time, I'm quite liking Michael Sierra. Do you know who he is? No. He's the kid out of like su- super bad, and um, he's done tons of other stuff. But it's the only one that I think you know off your back of your head. Anyway, yeah, he's just like one of his indie actors, so he's not really well known. But okay. I'm just enjoying. I'm just enjoying his stuff at the moment. I also like um, Cat Dennings because I'd I'd squirt, you know. <laughs> what? Now we've got I'd a seasonal up. question. What's your favourite thing about winter? <laughs> Squirting. <laughs> Uh, the favorite, my favorite uh, you get thing snowed in and then you don't have to go to work. There you go. <coughs> but we never get there's snow. A, it, yeah, oh, and here's the thing. It. When we do, we can't handle it here. Yeah, we can't. <laughs> and I fucking shit. hate... Yeah, being a bus driver, I fucking hate snow. Fucking hate it. <laughs> that's, yeah, that's not how it is here. Whenever it snows here, it really comes down. <laughs> Yeah, we, we, we just have to get snow plows. Yeah, in England we just have to get one snowflake and the fucking whole country stops. <laughs> yeah, oh, don't go outside; it'll eat you. There's no bread you or guys... milk. <laughs> <laughs> you guys will never understand. Like you guys will never. Well, you, you're not children anymore, so you won't have to. But you'll never know what it's like as a child to watch American television where it snows, and then you're like, "Oh my god, maybe this year it'll snow," and then your parents tell you. It, ha- it will never snow here. Like, it n- will never, ever fucking snow here in Australia. And then you're like, oh! <laughs> and then you don't believe them, and then you pray. Anyway, yeah. Look, yeah, but I, I, I don't feel sorry for you. You're the one that decides to live over there. <laughs> <laughs> to be honest with you. I did not. <laughs> to be honest with you, Shock is playing for, uh, instead of playing for, uh, like, a, a, a white Christmas, he's playing for, like, a, a Rasta Christmas. <laughs> Rasta what? Christmas. Rasta Christmas. Have What's a Barbie. <laughs> Play the beach what? ball. <laughs> what the hell is that? Play the steel drum. <laughs> Go <Let's> with surfing. <laughs> I think it's very clear at this point to the members of the podcast that Peter Day is high. Um, he's had some of the Rastafarian Old Holborn. You know, some of the some of the brownies. You know, he's had some of that. Um, I broke my popcorn. I'm very distressed. It, yeah, his microwave's not working, and no. he's had to resort to just a spliff. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> let your microphone be the next thing you break. <laughs> don't, don't know. This thing costs fucking like, a lot of money. <laughs> it costs more than my car. <laughs> I'm going to skip past the um, the question that says, uh, that says, do you enjoy your birthday? Um... <laughs> no. What's that fucking very stupid question? Okay. <laughs> okay, all right. What was your worst restaurant experience? Oh, too many. I had, I had an earwig in one of my Happy Meals when I was a kid. <laughs> How does that I don't know work? what earwig is, but I'm guessing it's earwax, is it? No, no, no it's a little <laughs> bug. Oh. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Fuck? Google earwig. <laughs> no, I'm okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a cockroach-style <laughs> thing, but not... <laughs> Yeah, so oh. basically, uh, got me happy meal. I'm all happy and excited. I'm about, probably about like eleven years old. <laughs> oh! Um, and I get the little toy in there, and I, I lift up the chip, and there's a fucking earwig in, in the bottom of the box. It's like, oh! <laughs> right, and the thing is, right, go back to the counter because we were actually in, in the restaurant, and the, and the guy says, "Well, you must have put it in there." What? And my mum's like, "What the what the fuck are you on about? What <laughs> kind of kid puts a fucking earwig in his food?" Is some guy making burgers with only one earwig in? He's like, "Yeah, oh, you fucking idiot!" <laughs> Ridiculous. <laughs> I love how I love how the guy at the back making burgers has got this heavy, thick set Australian accent <laughs> in Britain. Oh God, that's what an earwig is! Oh Jesus! I know. <laughs> I just looked it up. Like, it's freaking... What is that? Yeah. <laughs> They're fucking ugly, aren't they? Yeah. <laughs> it's, Chim- it's like a Chim- cockroach oh, and a... Oi, hang on, shock mouse. Something. Apparently, they're really super common in Australia. <laughs> I've never seen one. <laughs> Does it go outside? No, I... <laughs> no, I've seen one once, okay? And it's too distressing. I was a child, and my uncle had them next to his bed. But do you think people explain this to children what the hell they are? No. <laughs> They never explained to you what uh, what home improvements was. <laughs> no, I'm like, oh, it's squishy. Oh, a toy, yay! Fucking uncle's house has no toys except <laughs> this one, yay! 
<laughs> what about you? What about you, Shock? For your like your worst restaurant experience ever? Oh, um, I've got heaps. Hang on. What's the best <laughs> restaurant experience I had? Is he asking the missus again? Yes. Yeah, because she was probably there. <laughs> Shock's wife is basically Siri. <laughs> Oh my god, no. Well, I had a really bad time at this cafe. Right. And it's kind of it's kind of my fault. And I'm going to sound like a horrible person. <laughs> right? Okay, please I just tell me how it's your fault. <laughs> it's not my fault, but it kind of is. All right? I'd just gone through a major breakup um late 2010. Right. So I did what you do and um I had no friends really, so I was fucking making <laughs> friends. Oh my god. And so I you took... started his YouTube channel? <laughs> no, my YouTube channel was four years old at this point. <laughs> and he still had no friends? You shut the fuck up. <laughs> so, <laughs> I took... <laughs> I haven't even gotten to the cringy part. You're all clapping. <laughs> You're just funny. You're clapping like a seal. This was the darkest <laughs> moment in my life. You're <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry. Continue, chimp. Uh, sorry, continue, shock. I'll, I'll, I'll kick chimp out if I need to. So, um, I started talking to people online, right? And I right. would take like the I was becoming friends with to the local <laughs> get breakfast. Right. Um, one of um, so I took this girl and right. she complained about the butter. She said, "Is it salty? This butter or something? I can't fucking remember what." I'm like, "I'm thinking that's a bit weird. Why would you complain about that?" Um, he's like, oh, no, it's not, or something. So, anyway, I took another person there, and we're going to pay, and he said to her, different person, is the but was the butter too salty? And then without blinking, I just went, oh, no, that was someone else. And then he just stops dead and looks at me and goes, yeah, real subtle cunt. <laughs> Like, oh my god. And then we get outside and then I've realized, oh my god, he thinks I'm fucking them. He thinks I'm fucking both of them. Oh well, god. if you like, if you if you wasn't, you're doing something wrong. No, but here's the horrible part. He was right. <laughs> <laughs> he was right, but I was pissed off because he for all he, he knows he was out. wrong. There was no there was no, there was nothing there, like, to suggest that we were. <laughs> and I Definitely. really think we were. Like, I have been able to go back since, and even to this day, I avoid going anywhere near the vicinity of that joy. <laughs> and the other part is, the cafe was called Gossip Cafe. We can Google it. It, it was called Gossip Cafe. I was making gossip! <laughs> Where? Wait a minute, cafe? wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. You took a date to a cafe. Was it, is it in Sydney? Si restaurant. Shock, is it in Sydney? Yes. I'm just looking at it. Is it Gossip Cocktail Bar and Restaurant? Hang on. Uh, God. I'm trying to find it. <laughs> Did you just type in Gossip Cafe Sydney? Yes. <laughs> It, I, every single time I think of this story, it haunts me. <laughs> yeah, um, I I cringed through that story. To be fair, <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not, it's not that one, Peter. All right. How do you know in... you're looking at the same thing? Because we well... Google the same thing, <laughs> art. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but Australian in there might be different. Oh yeah, we forgot about that. <laughs> Innovator, what was your worst of restaurant experience? I'm actually glad to say that I don't have a worse. Wow, clean bill of health. Hey, what's your worst podcast experience? This one without fail. <laughs> right now. <laughs> Doesn't deny it. It's both the best and the worst because there's nothing else to compare it to. Oh. <laughs> That's probably a good thing, actually. Oh, yeah, We're not I compared get... to anything. Yeah, we're in our league of our own. The only thing that I had was um, we went to um, this place in an area of Kent called um, Faversham, and um, and it was for my partner's dad's birthday, 
and it was at this Italian restaurant, right? And I don't know quite how they fucking managed it, but they took like well over like an hour to make the food. Like, like we're talking like one into like the hour thirty, two hour mark to actually get the food out to the table. And when it was there, it felt like it had been made in a salt mine. It was salty. Oh, it. Trust me, your butter story. Okay, it, it like the salt must pale in comparison to. <laughs> the salt like all you could taste was salt it would be like if you got the salt out of a salt shaker and just gone fuck it i'm hungry and decide to eat that i am not joking it was fucking disgusting okay so so you you would, would you rather because remember the part of my story wasn't the, the butter the part of my story was that the guy thought i was fucking all these people and he shouldn't have been thinking that would you rather go through that or eat the salt thing again <sighs> Probably eat the salt thing again. <laughs> <laughs> Rather eat salt. <laughs> nice, bit, no, nice salt lick. One of those big, big ones you get for a horse. <laughs> it's a salt lick. It's a salt lick. Okay. I will order the salt lick and chips, please. <clears throat> right, and um, going away from the, uh, <laughs> go away from the topic generator for a bit. There was something I wanted to discuss, and that's a bit of the old YouTube drama. I just wanted what people's faults, uh, faults, faults were on the old uh, Fuji Tube Costa was crazy situation. I um, mm. I've not been too involved with this. I've not been paying too much attention, only because I've been locked away editing. Um, I've not had that much time to sort of pay attention. I watched a re-upload of like the start of Colossal's video. And it was really fucking funny, but I'm guessing it got taken down or something? Uh, yeah, yeah. W- way to contribute to the conversation there, Pete. <laughs> well, <laughs> fuck off then! I don't know what Bye. we're talking about. Get, no, wait, so, 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 no, Bye! Like, what I do know. Uh, let me catch you up, let me catch you up, alright? So basically, Colossal makes this 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 40 minute video, uh, and it's a masterpiece of a video, uh, exposing, well it's not really exposing, stating the facts about FusiTube and how he manipulates his his uh, audience into uh, believing society is worse than what it is. If you've seen a Fuji Tube video, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, so basically, about a minute ha- after Colossal uploads the video, Fuji Tube puts a content claim on it. Uh, 30 days go by, and f- about five hours before the claim's due to come off, because obviously Fuji Tube hasn't made uh, any um, advancements on, on on the video. Uh, he, he takes down the video, so this basically means that FujiTube gets all the ad revenue, and the, and the video's not up. Um, so at this point now, that FujiTube's now got to take legal action if he wants that video to stay down, uh, otherwise it will go back up in the next 30 days. Um, so now, obviously, you got um, <clears throat> Kloss has been fighting this the whole way, but as YouTube's so shit, they've let FujiTube get away with this. So now oh Kloss has got. And then they- Fooper involved and Pyrocynical and basically they're they're gonna fight it. So I find this story is quite important for the community as a whole because it is bullying. Like it's, it, it, there's no doubt in my mind that um, Colossal's channel falls under fair use. Yeah. And because Fuji yeah, Two does. doesn't like it, he's he's able to uh, claim it and strike it, and that's wrong. And that's what they're fighting. So yeah. I just wondered what your thoughts were on it. Yeah, that's so unfair. <laughs> Well, you guys are I mean, really that, fucking out for that. <laughs> it's just an absolute injustice. Uh, YouTube has been down the toilet since... Uh, I don't know what year exactly. For me, it's been down the toilet since early 2013, because that's when I joined, or when I started making videos. Uh, but uh, for you guys, one of you might have... Or you guys might have been on earlier than me. You might feel a little differently. To be honest I'm with shocked. you... To be honest with you, from like a, a platform level, um, Google has has done stuff that has not only made it because again people like to take sort of the the piss out of google for saying that it's the reason why google, uh, youtube is so shit nowadays but google has made youtube actually work nowadays because like you, f- you forget like how like bad it was like um in the past in terms of how the site was um uh, it's just yeah. the content that has changed really and it's unfortunately people seem to want to profiteer off this drama crap um and um and yeah, and, that, and that's unfortunately led people to want to pick fights with everybody left, right and centre. And it's just like, who's fighting who? I think I think there's a, there's a, 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 
a, fun, a, fundamental, a fundamental issue with the system um, because I mean I've been I've been copyright claimed quite a few times on videos you know like those Spider-Man videos and stuff you know videos that don't involve drama yeah but the, the people that make the original content always try to copyright claim it yeah uh, you know visual copy it. but my my videos always transform the, the content, content yes which makes it fair use because yeah. it's not the same content yeah uh, the I, problem um... with youtube uh, the problem with youtube and google is and i think uh, h3 said this is is the system is needed yes like that system is needed that system that is in place is definitely needed it's, it's a necessary evil but there is not enough people overseeing it so these big companies this uh, uh, places people like Studio uh, Seventy One Slash One or whatever has come up quite a bit uh, on mine, and then quite a few other people. That uh, these companies are taking advantage of a system that's not being overseen properly. Yeah, <clears throat> and smaller creators like myself are scared to fight the bigger corporations because their channel, their channels at risk. <clears throat> yeah, you know, and that's that's what it comes down to. So it is bullying. It is bullying, and this this is why this makes this this particular drama quite important. Um, because Colossal should win. There's no doubt in my mind that Colossal should win the the, the war. Um, if he doesn't, it doesn't look good for YouTube in the future. That's for damn sure. Yeah. Because um, the bigger people always have the advantage, and that's case, not a good thing. Case proven. Um, one of my videos I did a while ago, ago which was the uh, crappy music episode with Mass Text, uh, the the that blonde sort of bimbo chick that's thinking about why don't you get a mass text or something like, like mm. that fucking shit song um who was it full screen claim the video um and basically i thought well hang on a second this is fair use right so i appealed against it and then they upheld their thing so i have one of two choices i could either fight it which i know it's right um that i you know i know that i'm in the right or i can um and if i fight it i could risk a copyright claim or i could um let it like sort of uh, let it remain claimed essentially and not risk a strike on my channel and I've had to do that only because of fear that they will literally just go ahead and take it down anyway despite the fact that it's commentary and it's fair use yeah so I, 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 to that date to this day I have not I've not touched it I'm looking at it right now no. have just, you have you seen H3's video yes it made um, me. It made me I, think about. Do it. Made me think about appealing it. But the thing is, yeah. is that that is an old video now. It's not like I'm going to get any sort of monetary gain from it anyway. But it's not like I, I care about that too much. I think it's like, it's it's the fact that it's it's still claimed. I tried reaching out to full screen straight away, and then they dropped all contact with me in the end. And so it's the, the thing, thing is, is that you you're and I'm the same. I'm not going to say you're any different to me. What you're doing is exactly what everyone else is doing, but I think that everyone needs to start fighting. Even the smallest little things need to start fighting it, so they people know that these companies cannot get away with falsely claiming us. Yeah, I think that's what HP is trying to, to to say. Don't be afraid, because they use all this um, bullying terminology and frightful terminology, but you know, and it scares people off, and that's what it's designed to do. But really, you should be fighting those little things. If you really, truly think, truly think, 100% sure that your video is is transformative, then you fight it all to, to the death, you know? Yeah. Um, but yeah, like I said, like you just said, like so many creators are scared off of the fact that if you lose, you get a strike on your channel. Yeah. And maybe, maybe, maybe that shouldn't be the consequence. Yeah. Maybe that's what YouTube need to change, that you don't get a strike. Because you're just, you know, if the decision goes there, if YouTube is deciding, oh, no, it, it's not transformative, they get the money. That's fine. Why, 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 do, why do you have to strike the channel? Yeah. You, you're just, you're having a debate, you're arguing over whether it's transformative or not. There, there should be no repercussion. You know, I mean, you're already getting the repercussion because you're not getting the fucking ad revenue. Mm. So why put yeah. the strike on? That's just adding insult or injury as far as I'm concerned. Yeah. Anyway, um, I'm going to move on because Shock Mouse is going to sleep. Hello. I haven't. I've been listening. He's been listening, <laughs> but you know, Shock Mouse doesn't do any of this. He doesn't make content. Apparently, you don't have any <laughs> problems with this, do you, Shock Mouse? Well, no, because I well, 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 Maybe I want to start doing movie reviews soon, but actual proper ones, not like those ones in that podcast that I know you're going to fucking bring up. Like, oh. proper ones. <laughs> like, in the style of that video that I did on you and Pete. Maybe I want to fucking do that. You never know. But I'm, yes, I fine. totally want to do that. Be, yeah. Be very aware of the copyright stuff, though, and, um... Uh, is it her... Who's the, um... Who's the movie... Uh, thingy? Oh, God, his name's gone. Nostalgia Chris. Chris Stuck. No, the other Strackman? one. No. The other Ray one. Jeremy Johnson. 
fucking hell, his name's got... <laughs> oh, I can't remember. I'll remember his name after the podcast. There's a I few can't of them. I can't... Yeah, there's a few of them. Anyway, all of them. And even Alex at IHE has had problems with reviewing movies, so... Yeah, yeah you need to be cat. aware of that anyway, Shockmouth, so... <laughs> Oh, first um, one totally is going to be cool cat. For sure. <laughs> it seems to be a wise business decision. It helps you. Well, Chimp, you were surprised. <laughs> you were surprised on my live stream that I said that the person who uh, inspired me is Derek Savage. Yeah. <laughs> no, seriously. Like, really? Like, yeah, people laugh. And I'll tell you for why. Derek Savage has actually done more good than he's done harm in in YouTube. Yeah, yes, sure, he took down I Hate Everything's channel for a week, fucking him out of, like, views, money, uh, you know, and everything. But the thing is, is that as a result of him doing that, a conversation got started about people doing this, and so basically people started standing up to it, and other people had the ability, like me, for example, I, like, I owe my YouTube career to Derek Savage, because if it wasn't for his actions, I would not be, like, anywhere near, hey. like, the level of attention that I am today. Pete, can I ask you something? Yes. Does your missus, like, hate fuck you? Like, does she hate fuck the <laughs> shit out of you? <laughs> what kind of question is that? Is that on the does copy anybody, show, generator? Does anybody love you? <laughs> <laughs> Derek oh, Savage? Oh, oh you God. monster. <laughs> Call me Derek Savage. There's a little... There's, there's, there's a little button, um, Shockmouse. There's a little button. It says, it says Mitchell... Right, I'm going to click it. Oh, what's the first option on this list? Hang up. Oh, I wonder what happens if I click that. Oh, oh, go, oh, oh, he's gone. Oh, what a shame. Oh, uh, Shot Mouse, unfortunately, has gone to technical problems um, on the call. So, uh, so, uh, so, so, fuck you, Shot Mouse. You, you dick. Bigger YouTubers, brilliant, smaller YouTubers. You see what Hello? I mean? Shock? <laughs> Shock? <laughs> yeah. Shock, you're a dickhead. Yeah. <laughs> Now, Chris, some counters make you overpowered. <laughs> Are you mad at me? Don't do it again. <laughs> Are you mad at me? you <laughs> mad at him. Are you mad at me? Does your partner hate fuck you? Does anybody love you? Are you mad at me? <laughs> I mean, that's, that's a fair question. <laughs> <laughs> Are you mad at me? He's not having mad at me. We've got drama here. Drama here on Talk to the Hand. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Shock. Just don't do it again. <laughs> I thought you were, I'm like, oh my god, he's just shocked me. He just released my <laughs> game and then sprang up on me. Oh my god. Oh, we have to go. We have to buy a ticket to England. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit, this is Thanks. Iceland. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, let's go back to the topic. Uh, yeah, generator. We're, going sake. we're going desperately off topic. I think I've broken the random topic generator. Hang on. Uh... <laughs> Uh, uh, do you believe in love at first sight? Um, no, I believe in horny at first sight. <laughs> Shock please and hate fucking at first sight, apparently. <laughs> I would love to hate fuck her. <laughs> I would ram my cock up her ass. Dry, dry runner. <laughs> Right? Hateful. Dry runner. I wouldn't even spit on the tip. <laughs> <laughs> just uh, pop that right in there. Would you just hate so fun? you know, Jim, okay, that Jim. gives me the same reaction as the ear tip thing <laughs> story. That gives me the same <laughs> belly Jim. reaction. Jim. Ear just tip. sick. Jim, would you hate fuck <laughs> Becky Boop? <laughs> no, no. I, I would make sweet love. <laughs> Well, okay. All right. Here's a question for you. This is this isn't in the this isn't in the topic generator. But what music would be playing in the background, chimp? A smooth jazz. Yeah. <laughs> what the music that's in the podcast? The coffee shop. Podcast. The music's in the podcast. Right. I have shock mouth singing in the background. Come on, shocks. Give me some. Give me some singing. <laughs> Angry chimp. Yes, I can't. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's getting me hot. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He's a puppet who wants to fuck it. <laughs> and at least he doesn't abuse his friends. <laughs> like the idiot in Australia. <laughs> I didn't abuse you. I was <laughs> suggesting you had. You're testing had what? Sorry? That you should have. <laughs> Sorry? 
I was just saying that you idolize people that you should. <laughs> I told no, I'm not. I'm not idolizing fucking Derek Savage. I told you why I I am thankful that he did it because basically all's well that ends well. Loads of people became friends and actually got started on the platform. I wouldn't be talking to you guys if it wasn't for him. Well, my question still stands. <laughs> well, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and that is, do you hate fuck your missus? <laughs> when you're no, 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 not does he, does she, not, he, not does he, does she. Oh. Right. I'm going to call her, okay? I'm going to call her right now, okay? <laughs> right, hang on. <laughs> okay, I'm calling her. She's downstairs, you but I'm, ca- I'm going to call her, okay? You All right? the topic of interest. Okay, it's ringing, so, uh, it's ringing, okay? So, Silence, everyone. So, Silence, everyone. <laughs> Silence, everyone, I'm ringing her. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Right. Okay. The the people on the podcast they want to know a very important question. Okay. There are people on the podcast at all. Just shock mouths. Okay. 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 <laughs> do you do you hate fuck me? All the fucking time. Right. Fuck you. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> what did she say? I didn't even hear her. All the fucking time. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all the fucking time. Uh, Pete, you got a good girl there, mate. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's the uh, that's the safety word. <sighs> <laughs> if I'm going if I'm going too rough, just go. Uh-huh. Oh, my head hurts. <laughs> so, Chronic Innovator, how are you? Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'm laughing. <laughs> that's how I'm too. Uh. We can have a falling he... out, me and you, shocks. <laughs> <laughs> I think you've already had it. Like, yeah. Go back to the topic generator. What do you do in your spare time? <laughs> is just killing me. Chip wax off. I know that for sure. Yep. Yep. You got that done, right? Yep. Two photos of Becky Boop. <laughs> oh god. We want her to like this podcast, Chimp. You don't want to scare her away. Look, you've already scared her, Shock Mouse. All right. What did I do? You stalk her on her stream. Talking about hate fucking and shit. <laughs> yeah. I don't stalk that's, her on you know, her she, stream. She's not going to come on the podcast where she's got a horny little puppet and someone who likes to hate fuck. <laughs> <laughs> like, that's, not, that's not a podcast anyone wants to be on besides Connick and Evan. I don't like to hate fuck, chimp. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this, pod, this has gone downhill quick. This really has. Holy shit. The podcast right. has to hit rock bottom. Right, are we doing story time now, okay? Because I feel like I need a fucking laugh. Because <laughs> you haven't laughed? <laughs> it's all been external, I think... chimp. I think I've genuinely upset him. <laughs> right, right, right. You two guys sort this out on the podcast now. <laughs> Have you? Is he genuinely upset you, Pete? I don't know. Has he? Just answer the fucking thing, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> fucking use these fucking sarcasticness fucking bollocks to say yes or no no you haven't right are you happy with that shock mouth you little tart I don't know <laughs> we're gonna have to follow up next week <laughs> dun, dun, dun. <laughs> <laughs> right okay story time all right, we, we, you have to explain to Conic Innovator. So fucking done. Well, I explained to everybody. Okay, so basically we're writing a story. Um, we're going to send it to Penguin Books uh, because they're desperate to print stuff. Okay, and basically what happens is we are going to uh, come up with a story by saying a word each. Okay, to create a, uh, a flowing narrative. So basically I'll say a word, then Chimp, then Shock, and then you, Innovator. And then we'll go around in a circle until we've got a chapter. Okay, so I'm going to read you chapter three, which is called Excessive Flatulence from last episode. God. Said elephant man who farted on the cat. I didn't do that. You farted on Becky's cat. What did fucking Fred say about that bitch? He exclaimed, Bananas, taste my balls. Everybody loves balls. When Becky's nibbles get eaten, fried sandwiches are delicious, especially when farted upon. Peter thinks that farted animals is a disgusting except on toast. Now, of course, that story would make more fucking sense if Shock wouldn't just put random words in that didn't actually add to the flow narrative. But then again, he is pro-hate fucking, so it's something that I would fucking expect. <laughs> I didn't fuck that story. You guys do. <laughs> right, okay. I'm, I'll start with a word, okay? 
then <laughs> shock mouths hate <laughs> did you say fuck? angry chimp <laughs> or is that two words uh no, I was gonna say, that's uh, two words <laughs> chimp then sorry so hang on. hate fucked Angry. Where the fuck? Where did fuck come from? Eh? Where did the hate uh, uh, fuck come from? All right. Yeah. So okay. Then shock mouths hate ch uh, innovator. Chimp. <laughs> then shock mouths hate chimp. <laughs> because of his. Oh my god. Uh... <laughs> the, uh... His dick. Dick. <laughs> Full stop. <laughs> Shock mouths <laughs> was amazing. <laughs> innovator. You got dead air. <laughs> innovator. <laughs> shit. You don't have to, you don't have to say innovator. <laughs> oh, I thought that was. I thought Chimp was next. No, uh, sorry. Wait, what? <laughs> what was the last word? Shock Mouse was amazing. At. <laughs> Not. <laughs> <laughs> Being. Shit. <laughs> God, I'm so bad at this. Full stop. <laughs> Full stop. You started, Innovator. <laughs> Lazy. Cunt. <laughs> Dead. Sorry? Said. Shock mouths. <laughs> Peter. <laughs> Chimp. And. <laughs> Becky Boo. I'm you know, I'm Wait, not hearing you can't say you, two words. I just keep hearing names. You can't say two words. You can't say two words. Incoherently back and forth. I don't know All how right, to make a sentence out of it. Becky. Okay. Uh, innovator? Myself. <laughs> All? Went. <laughs> Hate. <laughs> Fuck's sake! <laughs> <laughs> Look, try and make it make sense. It's like, oh, went hate. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That's what I said. Yes, well, the ne if the next word is fucking, it'll make sense. <laughs> yes, but he might not say that. that. Well, I'm handing it to him on a silver platter. <laughs> he doesn't want to say fucking. <laughs> Innovator. Uh. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> Cow. Ouch. <laughs> I fucking hate this couch. <laughs> Shopping. Trolleys. <laughs> <laughs> fucking erections. I don't know. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Go on, elevator. <laughs> at. E.T. At. At. Walmart. Ah. <laughs> uh. Depressing. <laughs> <laughs> All I got uh. was at Walmart depressing. <laughs> uh, one more. Go on, elevator. <laughs> Um, Jake. From. State. Farm. Is. <laughs> going. Queer. <laughs> so chapter four, everybody. Hey, uh, no, no, no. Four. Queer four. <laughs> four. Okay. Innovator. Last Sleep. word. Sorry? <laughs> I think you said Pete. Pete. <laughs> I fucking hate you all. Right, chapter four. Yeah. <laughs> chapter four. Okay. Then Shockmouths hate Chimp because of his dick. 
Shock mouth was amazing <laughs> at not being shit. Lazy cunt, <laughs> said Shock mouth. Peter, Chimp, and Becky, myself, all went hate couch shopping trolleys. <laughs> Erections at Walmart are depressing. Jake from the State Farm is going queer for Pete. <laughs> it's like country. <laughs> 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 and the title uh, of that episode is Hate Fucking. <laughs> but no, that's not in there. You should just call it Trolley Erections or something. <laughs> Getting erections at Walmart. <laughs> trolley Erections. <laughs> right. Okay, I think we've run out of time, guys. We're a little bit over. Um, Getting raped by Jacobs from State Far. <laughs> and that's where we end. Goodbye, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> bye. Bye. Well, we same goodbye. I know. I'm bye. I'm angry chimp. <laughs> there we go. No. <laughs> 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 <laughs>